It's been months since we last heard from Lord Archimonde. I grow tired of watching over these rotting undead. What are we still doing here? We were charged with overseeing this land, Detherok. It is our duty to remain here and ensure that the Scourge is ready for action. True, though we should have received some kind of orders by now. The Legion was defeated months ago. How could they not know? Impossible to say. But the longer they remain in command, the more they run the Scourge into the ground. What? How could possibly... Greetings, Dreadlords. I should thank you for looking after my kingdom during my absence. However, I won't be requiring your services any longer. Prince Arthas, this land is ours. The Scourge belongs to the Legion. Not anymore, demon. Your masters have been defeated. The Legion is undone. Your deaths will complete the circle. Never! This isn't over, human. We knew you would return to us, Prince Arthas. I have returned, Lich. But you will now address me as king. This is, after all, my land. Now we must secure the kingdom by scouring the last remnants of humanity from it. But my king, the humans have begun to abandon their villages. They are fleeing to the canyon passes. If they escape into the mountains, it will be impossible to hunt them all down. Then we must slaughter them before they escape. Their deaths will be a fitting tribute to Nerzul. The pain is unbearable. What is happening to me? Danger draws near. Power is fading. Time is running out. King Arthas, do you need assistance? No. The pain is past, but my powers are diminished. Something is terribly wrong here. Shall we recall our forces? No, I will finish the hunt. We'll solve this mystery once our business is done. At last, the Alliance is finished. Once we round up the last stragglers, we should be... Ugh, not again. It is I, the Lich King. Danger draws near the Frozen Throne. You must return to Northrend immediately. Obey, obey! My King, you are not well. Take me back to the capital. I have a long journey ahead of me. Lady Sylvanas, we are pleased that you came. How could I not? For some reason, I no longer hear the Lich King's voice in my head. My will is my own once again. You Dreadlords seem to know why. We've discovered that the Lich King is losing his power. As it wanes, so too does his ability to command undead such as you. And what of King Arthas? What about his powers? Though his Runeblade Frostborn carries powerful enchantments, Arthas' own powers will fade in time. It is inevitable. You seek to overthrow him, and you want my help to do it. The Legion may be defeated, but we are the Nathrazim! We'll not let some upstart human get the best of us. Arthas must fall. The Lich Kalthazard is far too loyal to betray his master. But you, on the other hand... Hate him. I have my own reasons for seeking vengeance. Arthas murdered my people and turned me into this monstrosity. 
I may take part in your bloody coup, but I will do so in my own way. I, for one, do not trust her. Her heart is still elven. She will never side with us. Don't be too hasty. She has great spirit, but her hatred for Arthas will ultimately serve our cause. Agreed. Well, if that's settled, let the festivities commence. So the seizures have been getting worse? Yes. With my powers drained, I can barely command my own warriors. The Lich King warned me that if I didn't reach Northrend soon, all could be lost. Fear not, my king. Everything has been prepared for your departure. The ships are waiting at the coast, and... There's been a change of plans, King Arthas. You're not going anywhere. Assassins! It's a trap! You should never have returned, human. Weakened as you are, we have assumed control over the majority of your warriors. It seems your reign was short-lived. There are too many of them, my king. Flee! Escape from the city! I'll find my own way out and meet you in the wilderness. All right, Lich. Good luck. We have no time for this. We must find our way out quickly. You have my thanks, ladies. But where is your mistress? Where is Sylvanas? She sent us to find you, Great King. We've come to escort you across the river. Once we cross it, we'll take refuge in the wilderness. This is the place, sisters. We'll rest here, Great King. Why here? We've got to find Kel'Thuzad before we- You have been deceived. Come to my side at once. Obey! What is happening here? Sylvanas. You walked right into this one, Arthas. It's time to even the scales. Traitor! What have you done to me? It's a special poisoned arrow I made just for you. The paralysis you're experiencing now is but a fraction of the agony you've caused me. Finish me, then. A quick death? Like the one you gave me? No. You're going to suffer as I did. Thanks to my arrow, you can't even... Give my regards to hell, you son of a bitch. Back, you mindless one! You shall not fall today, my king. This isn't over, Arthas. I'll never stop hunting you. The effect of her arrow will wear off in time. All the preparations for your journey to Northrend have been made. You have been a loyal friend, Kalthazad. I don't know what the future holds, or if I'll even return. But I want you to watch over this land. See to it that my legacy endures. I shall, King Arthas. I shall. You seem troubled, mistress. Aren't you, sister? Only days ago we were the Lich King's slaves. We existed only to slaughter in his name. And now, we are... free. I don't understand, mistress. I thought you'd be overjoyed. What joy is there in this curse? We are still undead, sister. Still monstrosities. What are we if not slaves to this torment?
Greetings, Lady Sylvanas. My brothers and I appreciate the role you played in overthrowing Arthas. I've come to offer you a formal invitation to join our new order. Baron Mothras. My only interest was in seeing Arthas dead. I have no time for your petty politics or power mongering. Careful, my lady. It would be unwise to incur our wrath. We are the future of these plague lands. You can either join us and rule, or be cast aside. I lived as a slave long enough, Dreadlord. I won't relinquish my freedom by shackling myself to you, fools. So be it. Our reply will come soon. Sylvanas, spare my life. I beg you. I can be of service. I swear it. Just like a demon, you'd sell your brethren out just to save your own skin. I'm listening. I know what my brother's plans are. I know where their forces are based. Just let me serve you, and I'll help you defeat them. All right, Baron Mothras. I'll let you prove your loyalty to me. But be warned. I'm keeping you on a short leash. Northrend. It feels like a lifetime since I was last here. Something out there is threatening the Lich King. We must reach Ice Crown quickly. My King, we'll need to establish a base here first. But this island is nearly devoid of resources. What the? They look like High Elves. What are they doing here? Prince Arthas, we are the Blood Elves. We have sworn to avenge the ghosts of Quel'Thalas. This dead land will be cleansed. Northrend belongs to the Scourge, Elf. You made a terrible mistake by coming here. Slay them! Onward for the Scourge. Slay them in their soul's name. Who the... Thanks for the assistance, Mighty One. The Lich King sent me to aid you, Death Knight. I am Anubarak, ancient king of Ajol Narub. I welcome your aid, Anubarak, but we have little time for pleasantries. We must reach Ice Crown immediately. These elves are pathetic. It's no wonder we destroyed their homeland so easily. Pity I wasn't there to stop you. It's been a long time, Arthas. Prince Kael'thas, I haven't seen you since... You lead these elves? This group, at least. What you faced here was merely a scouting force. Defeating Lord Illidan's army will be far more difficult. Illidan? He's behind this invasion? He is. Our forces are vast, Arthas. Even now they march upon the Ice Crown Glacier. You'll never make it in time to save your precious Lich King. Consider this payment for Quel'Thalas and other insults. Make haste, my enemies draw near. Our time is almost spent. Are you well, Death Knight? My powers are weakening, but I'll be all right. He's right. We'll never reach the glacier in time. There is another route we might take, Death Knight. The ancient shattered kingdom of Azul Narub lies deep below us. Though it has fallen on dark times, it could provide us a direct shortcut to the glacier. We have little choice. Lead on, Anubarak. At least I still have enough power to do this. Most impressive. 
but you need to conserve your energies, Death Knight. We have a long road ahead of us. You're certain we can reach the glacier through these tunnels? Nothing is certain, Death Knight. The ruins will be perilous, but it's worth the risk. All right, let's go. You've done well, Varamalgras. You've led us straight to Deatherock's stronghold. But tell me, who are those humans? Deatherock used his telepathy to enslave a top-ranking human warlord. I believe his name was Garabon or Gilathos or something. Human names all sound the same to me. Instead of stamping it out, Deatherock has taken control of the last pocket of human resistance. They maintain their own army within the keep. Your brother is more clever than I thought. His defenses are considerable. Yes. And with this paltry force you've mustered, a direct assault on his walls would be suicide. I have no intention of assaulting the walls. Then let's go before he... My banshees will possess those hapless humans. We'll use them to open the gates for us. You realize we'll have only a short amount of time before he discovers what we're up to? Of course. If we strike quickly enough, Deatherock will never know what hit him. Whom do you serve, human? The Dark Lady. I am hers to command. The patrol has returned. Open the gates! Ready yourselves. The moment is upon us. Now, my warriors, strike! The spell has been lifted. Is the nightmare finally over? Stand down, humans. I have no quarrel with you. What is it you want, Elf Witch? We have a common enemy. The last Dreadlord Balmazar currently controls the capital city of your kingdom. If you help me kill him, I'll see to it that you get your lands back. Why should we trust you? You're part of the scourge that drove us out in the first place. Not anymore. My only interest here is vengeance. Ah, very well. I'll rally what's left of my forces and meet you outside the gates. Come now. You have no intention of giving them their lands back. Of course not. The humans are simply a means to an end. You sound more like one of us with every passing day, my lady. Watch it, Dreadlord. The capital city is heavily defended. Balnazar is no fool, my lady. This battle can be won only through attrition. What's the matter, demon? Are you afraid? Watch your tongue, human dog. Your hollow bravado does not impress- Stand down, gentlemen. Save your anger for Balnazar. Garethos, I'll lead my forces in a frontal assault while you attack the city from the rear. An aggressive ploy, milady. So long as we get our capital back, I'll stick to whatever strategy you wish. Give the order. Let the attack commence. Lord Gerethos, our scouts have found the missing band of dwarves. They appear to be lost in the wilderness nearby. Those brainless dwarves are almost more trouble than they're worth. However, we'll need them on the front lines. I'll have to lead them myself. Can't you idiots follow simple orders? There's a war on and you louts are off having a picnic. Get this column rolling immediately. Right away, Lord Garethos. Move them out, lads! Oh, they don't pay us enough to put up with that asshole. 
It's over, Balnazar. Varamothras. Yes, my lady. Kill him. But I... It is forbidden for one of the Nathrazim to kill another. My defection was one thing, but this... I require one last test of your loyalty, Dreadlord. Do it. You wouldn't dare! There, your business is done. Now I want you wretched animals out of my city before I... Kill him, too. Gladly. The capital city is ours, but we are no longer part of the Scourge. From here on out, we shall be known as the Forsaken. We will find our own path in this world, Dreadlord, and slaughter anyone who stands in our way. We've been walking for hours. We've got to quicken our pace. The Lich King is defenseless without us. I left many of my warriors at Ice Crown before I came to find you, Death Knight. They will hold the line for as long as they are able. Tell me, where are all of your people? Shouldn't there be Nerubians around here, undead or otherwise? I've been wondering about that myself. Something must have driven them all off. We did, you rotting bastards! We've been watching you all along! Muradin's dwarves. Impossible. Doesn't anyone stay dead anymore? We've been wandering this forsaken land ever since you killed Muradin and left us to rot, Arthas. Our leader, Balgun, led us into the ruined city to survive. But there's no way we're letting you in. We have no time for these games. Sathiron, attack! Well done, mighty Sathiron. I wish we could take you with us, but the confines of the Dark Earth are no place for you. The Lich King's time is running short. We must hurry. Send off the charges! Blow the bridge before they get across! No! Stop them before they... That was for Muradin. Now you'll never get across. There are other passages through the Labyrinth, Death Knight. We will find another way. I remember you, evil prince. You're the one that killed poor Muradin. Get over it already. I won't let you through this door, traitor. The recent quakes have awakened dark things under the ice. Ancient, horrid things. We vowed to keep them locked where they are. We'll take our chances, Dwarf. We're going through that door, one way or another. The air smells awful in here. Something doesn't feel right. If the Dwarf's story was true, there's no telling what awaits us in the darkness. This stairwell leads into the heart of the old Nerubian Empire. We must be cautious. By all means, you first. We have entered the Old Kingdom. Be wary, Death Knight. Whatever scared the dwarves still lurks down here somewhere. It cannot be a forgotten one. Look to your defenses, Death Knight. Fight as you've never fought before. We cannot take them all. 
Hurry, Death Knight! Up the stairwell! Hurry! We're running out of time, Anubarak. How far are we from the exit? Not far. We have entered the Upper Kingdom. The exit should lead us to the base of the glacier itself. However, there are still hidden traps and pitfalls to account for. Take cover! Arthas! The entire passage collapsed. There's no time to dig through this. I'll have to move quickly and find my own way out. Hopefully Anubarak and the others survived. Anubarak, you made it. I see now why the Lich King chose you as his champion, Death Knight. Few men could have survived this labyrinth alone. Now quickly, head through that door. The exit to the surface lies just beyond. It'll be good to see the sun again. Remember, Illidan and the true battle still await us in the world above. Hopefully our trek through the Dark Earth bought us the precious time we needed. We've made it, Anubarak. Our forces are already assembled and waiting. Greetings, King Arthas. You've arrived just in time. Illidan's Naga and Blood Elf forces have taken up positions at the base of the glacier and... Arthas, my champion. You have come at last. Master? There is a fracture in my prison, the Frozen Throne. And my energies are seeping from it. That is why your powers have diminished. But how? The room that made Frostborn was once locked inside the throne as well. I thrust it from the ice, so that it would find its way to you, and then lead you to me. And so it has. For now, we face a grave danger. My creator, the demon lord Kil'jaeden, sent his agent here to destroy me. If they should reach the frozen throne before you, all will be lost. The scourge will be undone. Now hurry, I will grant you all the power I can spare. I saw another vision of the Lich King. He has restored my powers. I know now what I must do. It's time to end the game. Once and for all. Time's running out, Anubarak. We've got to get inside the throne chamber before Illidan does. The throne chamber lies within the frozen peak at the center of the valley. It can only be opened by activating the four enchanted obelisks that surround it. Illidan's forces have already entrenched themselves near two of them. We'll need to drive them back and reactivate the obelisks ourselves. We're sorry to interrupt your meditation, Master, but all our forces are in place. Once the chamber is opened, we will destroy the Frozen Throne, as promised. Then the hour has come at last. After today, the Scourge will meet its end. Can you hear me out there, Arthas? Its end! Illidan has mocked the Scourge long enough. It's time we put the fear of death back in him. We've done it, Anubarak. The throne chamber is open. This is the hour of the Scourge.
the frozen throne is mine, demon. Step aside. Leave this world and never return. If you do, I'll be waiting. I have sworn to destroy it, Arthas. It must be done. Never. Some prince you find me dead in the cold. Return. 